in the series android app development in the previous lessons we had already installed the latest java version and then we had also installed the latest android studio version today we will see how to install the device driver so that we can connect our device to the android studio and then we can deploy our app onto the mobile phone so currently i have Redmi 8 Note Pro. So I have a Redmi 8 Pro device. So I'll search the device driver for Redmi 8 Pro. So I'll go to the Google and I'll search search for Redmi. I'll search for Redmi Note 8 Pro device driver. And we need to download the USB driver so that we can connect our phone using USB to the uh, PC. So this is Xiaomi Redmi Note 8 Pro USB driver. I'll click on the website. So there are multiple websites that will provide you the driver. So we can uh, search for the driver. You can see here it's the Qualcomm USB driver. You can download a Qualcomm USB driver or you can download the uh, ADB driver. And then we need to install it and uh, using the device manager. So I am using this Android ADB driver. So uh, let me click on the get driver. And once I have, uh, you can see the download is completed. I'll go to the folders. And I'll extract this driver here. So this is the USB driver for the Redmi Note Pro. You can see the extraction location is C, user, my username, then downloads and USB driver window. So I'll extract it here. So you can see the extraction is completed and we had downloaded the USB driver. Now we need to install this driver into our system. For that purpose, we will go to the uh, settings and we will open device manager. So I'm clicking on this device manager and inside this device manager, I'll go to the actions tab and I'll click on add driver. So once I clicked on this add driver, it will automatically identify the uh, location of just downloaded driver. And if it does not identify, we can click here on the browse button and we can go to the location which was you can see the downloads and then we will go to the recently downloaded USB driver. So let's let's see what was the recent folder and that was the USB driver R13. Okay, so we need to go to the USB driver R13. So let's go to the Okay, this is the folder. So I'll select this folder. I'll click on OK. So this is our downloaded folder. And I'll check on this include subfolder so that it will identify the driver file. And now I'll click on next. And you can see it's uh, installing the driver. And it is asking, would you like to install the device driver? I'll click on yes. So now the driver is successfully installed in our system. So now I'll click uh, close here. And it is advisable to restart your system once and then uh, continue with the process. So I am restarting my system. Okay, I have restarted the system and uh, we had just installed the device driver software for the Redmi 8 Pro. Now I will uh, now we will see that how we can deploy our Android app into the mobile phone. So now let me open the Android Studio which we had uh, installed previously in the previous session. So this is the latest version Android Studio Chipmunk. We have already created a project here with the name My App. You can see this My App we had created. Uh, when we had installed this Android Studio. Today we will uh, deploy our this app onto the mobile device Redmi 8 Pro. So 
So here you can see this is the run button or deployment button. But before we deploy, uh, we need to have a device connected to this Android Studio. Here you can see in the device list, we are having no devices currently. And you can see that uh, we can create a virtual device as well or we can uh, deploy our app onto a real device. So today we will deploy the device, uh, we will deploy the app on a real device and in the next training session I will let you know how you can create a virtual device as well. So for that purpose before connecting the phone we need to follow few steps in our mobile phone. These steps are just uh, activating developer options in the mobile phone for this these steps are uh, you can uh, go to the about phone section and then you will click on I am UI number seven times this will enable the developer options in your mobile phones then we'll go inside the developer options and we will click on USB debugging and inside that we'll also click on install via USB. So we will allow these uh, permissions and then I will connect my PC using the USB. So I have connected my phone using the USB and uh, I need to select file transfer mode. So there are uh, multiple modes in our mobile phones charging only or file transfer mode. So I have a uh, chosen the file transfer mode and once you have connected this uh, phone and you have clicked on USB debugging on you can see here in the device list now Xiaomi Redmi Note 8 Pro is listed. So we have selected the device and uh, click on this run button and you can see you can see this is asking to install so we will click on install in the mobile phone and uh, in the mobile phone here it's your app currently we have not anything in the app we just have a fragment a label button we have two fragments so this is how we can deploy our android studio app into the mobile phone